going through changes I'm just so mad right now, I can't even think straight Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Today's a Sunday, I feel so shitty I'm so hungover, I have the worst type of hangover You know that hangover that's like mixed with a bit of depression Like post group depression vibes I'm hungover, I'm sad I woke up and I started crying because I just feel so detached from my body anyway yeah but anyway I managed to get out of the house and get a smoothie go for a walk which made me feel a little, little bit better but then I had so many errands to run because I'm hosting a bride today honestly I would have wanted to cancel this bride but my friends don't come over to Cape Town that often so it's nice to do a little something cute for them and with them. But yeah, let's just prepare for the bar because I don't have much to say. I'm just going through. Why don't you get it by now? Tell me what you learned in grade school. Give it to me like you want it. Did you forget that cool? Why is I love it one sided? It should really be give and take. Fill you up and leave me empty Baby, was that the my mistake? Covering these feelings Going through changes I'm just so mad right now I can't even think straight So I'ma just Tweet it and delete it Knowing you won't read it Before we get too far away I need to clear my Baby! What's up? I'm so happy to see you. Good day. You guys will not believe. If you follow me on TikTok um, and you've watched my TikTok videos, you will know that I didn't have an opener. <laughs> ah, I'm so happy I have one. This is like healing. It's a, it's a, it's a healing moment for my inner child. I wonder how much this thing is even. Like, really, really, why didn't we have this thing at home? <laughs> I know that's right. I usually make my own chocolate from scratch, but it's always missing that tangy, sour vibe. You already know what it is. <laughs> then you gotta do it again. You let me fly, bro. <laughs> Cedric! Back to her. I'll show you guys the aftermath of yesterday. Like honestly, we had such a great time. But as you can tell, my voice is completely gone. I'm so sick. I've been sick like 
the whole day i've been in bed the whole day i don't know i think i'm coming down with the flu but i feel like absolute shit and i just decided to take it like completely easy today and that's what i did I'm so tired but no regrets literally tomorrow is a brand new day i'm gonna show you what this house looks like you guys just need to that's some vitamin c and some medication because this is embarrassing kind of but yeah if you are wondering if my place ever looks dirty now you have your answer honestly why do we have a bottle of tequila under the table what was going on make it make sense so grateful for my cleaner at this point i'm so embarrassed she's literally gonna get here and be like what is happening just don't have the strength i feel like hell but yeah i'm gonna show you what this place looks like tomorrow i don't have a, a closure wig but i do have like a very old one literally from the time i was saying in Durban. that's what that looks like i'm just trying to revamp it because i'm trying to like have something that i couldn't put on on the go i did bleach the ends a little bit but I think I'm going to bleach them a little bit more and give it like a blunt cut. So yeah, let's just do that quickly. I actually have a meeting in like an hour and a half and I'm trying to make something to eat. But I still feel like something fatty. <laughs> I think I should make a smoothie actually. And my cleaner is here so... There's a lot of cleaning happening. Guys, I finished doing my hair, but it's kind of the ghetto. I was rushing. I was running late, I have a meeting at 12.30, but yo, Sam, I'm like 10 minutes late, but I'm so excited to show you guys. Okay. The walls are up. Oh my god. I'm waiting for you outside to sign in this. On the other side. Okay. This is like my office, literally. Can you imagine? This is my office and like that's all the planning and stuff, furniture that just arrived. But we, just, we can't um, take it out of the boxes yet. So I see that they just moved from there. There's going to be a shelf thing over there. Just waiting to get the LED lights installed and stuff. And that's like a reception of it. This is merely a photo area. There's gonna be like a mirror over there. I parked outside my local Woolies because I wanted to get some cheese. I wanna make some pasta. I'm so, so sick, but I'm those people that just can't nap during the day. Like I can't ever nap during the day. And I tried it. I tried to get back into bed, but at least I was resting and not really like trying to do too much yeah and then I just got up now to drop my help off at the rank I was actually so shocked to see how far her taxi rank is like it is so far she has to walk so so long and you know I mean I just can't commit to picking her up and dropping her off every morning I'd love to but sometimes it's just not possible like sometimes I'm just like super busy or not around shame I feel bad but every time I can I'm just gonna drop off and pick up I didn't even show you guys this hair this is how it ended up coming out I haven't actually you know what I didn't want to like straighten it in this way I was actually trying to achieve like you know like those really bouncy curls but then I realized that I don't have enough time for that so I just sort of like quickly straighten the whole thing and then 
curl the friend slightly I tried to cut some of the ends this is a really old wig so yeah I'm actually not mad at how it came out but obviously it could have been better but I mean oh, yeah, winter changes I'm just so mad right now I can't even think straight so I'm a just tweet it and delete it guys my place is so clean like everything is where it usually is this is what gets me literally i love a clean house yo sana i literally love it here it's so clean i'm actually just gonna cook and the recipe will be on my tiktok of course gonna listen to some music and just vibe out. I want to have a glass of wine for vibes, but I don't think that's a very good idea. But who cooks without some wine? Come on. I need a tripod and I need a light. Oh, creating content is so much work, so now, Like, yo. And I know, I know I make it look easy, but damn. But I think, man, I just love it. <laughs> it's so hot. Like, I'm so excited to sit down and edit this vlog. I don't even know how I'm gonna edit it. But you know what, Sana? I'm just gonna edit it, job because. Wow. Yeah, so. This is. I use this phone for my TikTok. Because it's like of better quality. This is the Pro Max. And it doesn't have a, like, it's got more space as well. And I always film in 4K and 60 frames per second, just in case anyone's wondering. And yeah, I really like that little spot here because I usually have groceries and unpack them. And, 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 anyway. I'm literally trying this hack way. People put onions on the yeah. Ah, how am I gonna get to the bed? Shit, should have done it in bed. So I tried this onion egg last night. Honestly, I don't know if it worked, but I feel so much better. That's what the onion looks like. Honestly, I feel a bit better, but these bad boys stink. But apparently, that's what chases away all the viruses and infections. But a lot better than I was feeling yesterday. Thank God for that. I just want to really get back into my routine today, get back to work. I've got so much work to do. Work is like voiceover stuff which I couldn't really afford to do because my voice was like so horrible so I'm just happy to be feeling a bit better and can actually speak Good morning, going to the gym y'all I haven't been to the gym in ages and today I just woke up no, I know, it wasn't today actually yesterday <clears throat> I was um like in a bit of a funk so I did a bit of self care and I just realized that, you know what, this whole not working out, not leaving the house thing was cool and cute and whatever, but it's just not going to work out for me. Like, it just does not work out. Staying indoors makes me so depressed. It makes me lazy. And I'm in a very busy period right now. So I can't, I can't stay indoors because it just makes me feel like I can't do much, you know? I feel like we really underestimate the, the the power, the ability that like moving around gives us, you know. I find that when I'm like really like busy and I'm still also going to the gym and stuff, it makes it seem like a walk in the park, you know. I think it's just because I've already got the discipline, I've already got the physical capacity, I've got the mental strength to do whatever it is that I need to do during the day like gym gives me that like green light and then I'm able to like kick ass during the day and go to bed super exhausted but also super fulfilled you know 
staying at home and lazing around and you know in between being super busy and stuff just allows you to have a lazy approach on things and it's just not working out for me because it's making me overwhelmed it's making me feel stressed and 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 just super unhealthy i'm also not a very sickly person like i've been so sick the past week and it's like weird because i just got off my period the only time i'm like super super sick is when i'm on my period so i just got on off my period and now i feel i fall sick again and it's like three weeks of just not moving being sick not being in a routine and at first literally i got really bad pms and i thought to myself okay you know it's fine i can actually just take it easy listen to my body things like that and then now i'm just like okay wrap it up i'm good for it but yeah i want to go do an apartment viewing i know feels like i'm always moving right yeah but yeah anyway i'm looking for a new apartment um and i think i want to stay in funny because at first i thought i wanted to stay in you know like out of the city like really in like inland you know lots of lots of plants and stuff that's what i thought i wanted initially and then now i'm just like mm, i think i want to be a city girl i have this vision like i think I just recently found like a place that's like developing these really NYC inspired um, apartments and yeah I think I want to live there first before I decide where I want to <laughs> settle down. I, I will move. One thing about me, I'm the most easily uninspired person. If I start feeling weird or uninspired in a space, like I will move, and it's a bad, it's a good and a bad thing. But for me, it's been, it's been, it's been a pretty good thing, you know. But now I think the older I'm getting, the more I want like stability, and I want to feel like stable. But I still just don't know where I would settle down. Like I don't know where I want to eventually buy a house. To be honest, I don't even feel like it's South Africa. Like, honestly, I if I wasn't so busy with sex at the moment, I would have probably been preparing to leave the country. That was my plan. I was not going to stay in Cape Town for long. I was always just going to use Cape Town to figure out, like, am I really moving out of the country or not? It just feels weird moving straight from Joburg out of the country. So, yeah. It's half past seven, but Cape Town is such a small city, it's such a slow city, like, it actually feels like it should be eight or nine. In winter, the sun comes up so late. I remember when I first moved here, I was so thrown off because in Joburg, I would wake up at like five. finish off my nails so these are not the nails that I wanted to do I was just so cold at that nail place and obviously I'm still recovering from flu so I just wanted to get home and take a shower and get warm like ASAP because like my bones were so I was so cold like and a sweater sweat sweatpants and socks I'm still gonna wear a jacket because I'm so cold I don't feel well like at all Sure, let me just go make some hot lemon and ginger tea because wow. So I didn't record the whole process, but yeah, this is basically what the wig looks like once it's been customized. 
see how that hairline looks a little bit more natural i'm just gonna package it and send it right back yeah let's pack it up and yeah this is how i'm gonna send it back guys i'm like ugh, i love this <laughs> let me send this back to her we're at the studio ah oh, they finally put this wall up how pretty it's gonna be so pretty i love in in love wow this is new they've put in plugs they dropped down the wall watch with the rhythm just had um, athletic Pilates athletic which I've never done I usually do a line and you Sana I was literally really feeling like oh my god I'm so heavy because most of it like is gravity and you use your body oh, yo, 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 yo. I nearly died it was great you know it was a great challenge but why gotta be that difficult <sighs> the last day of this vlog I started last week Sunday and even though it's been like bits and pieces of what's been happening every day not the whole day that's what I can do right now <laughs> I'm feeling a bit better like thank the Lord for that I need to have a better week this week it's raining so wet and gloomy and cold look at the clouds Wow, and kept on wind so wild. Just look at what it did to that bin. Wow, this feels so nice. I'm just gonna go to the market just to get some breakfast. I actually want to spend the rest of the day editing. Um, yeah, I hope you guys see this vlog today, but I have, I have doubts. But yeah, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a huge thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I'll see you in my next video.